currency conundrum. Exploring the myth of wealth through printing. In the complex world of economics, one question has long intrigued policymakers and citizens alike. Can a country simply print more currency to become wealthy? Join us as we unravel the intricacies of this enigmatic conundrum and explore the implications of such a notion. The Illusion of Wealth at first glance, the idea of printing more currency to boost a nation's wealth may seem enticing. After all, more money circulating in the economy could lead to increased spending, investment, and prosperity. However, the reality is far more nuanced. According to The Economist, printing excessive amounts of currency can lead to inflation, eroding the value of money and causing prices to soar. Inflation diminishes the purchasing power of individuals and can ultimately undermine economic stability. According to Central Banker, central banks carefully manage the money supply to maintain price stability and support sustainable economic growth. While some level of inflation is considered normal, excessive money printing can destabilize the economy and erode public confidence in the currency. The Spiral of Inflation As the printing presses churn out more currency, the flood of money into the economy can trigger a vicious cycle of inflation. Rising prices compel businesses to increase their prices, wages to rise, and consumers to demand higher salaries, perpetuating the inflationary spiral. According to historian, throughout history, governments have grappled with the temptation to print money to finance wars, stimulate economic growth, or alleviate debt burdens. Yet the consequences of such actions are often dire, resulting in economic turmoil and societal upheaval. The Burden of Debt Moreover, the temptation to print money as a quick fix for economic woes can exacerbate the problem of national debt. Governments may resort to borrowing to finance their spending, leading to a cycle of debt accumulation that weighs heavily on future generations. According to fiscal policy advisor, while it may provide temporary relief, printing money to cover deficits only kicks the can down the road, burdening future generations with the consequences of unsustainable debt levels. It's a short-sighted approach that ultimately undermines long-term economic health. The importance of productivity True wealth and prosperity stem not from the quantity of currency in circulation, but from the productivity and innovation of a nation's workforce. Investing in education, infrastructure, and technology fosters long-term economic growth and competitiveness on the global stage. According to development economist, countries that focus on improving productivity, fostering innovation, and creating an enabling environment for businesses to thrive are the ones that truly prosper in the long run. Printing more currency is a band-aid solution that fails to address underlying structural challenges. The Road to Sustainable Wealth While the notion of printing more currency to become rich may hold superficial appeal, the reality is far more complex. Sustainable wealth is built on sound economic fundamentals, prudent fiscal policies, and investments in human capital and innovation. According to the policy advisor, governments must pursue a balanced approach to economic management, prioritizing long-term sustainability over short-term fixes. This requires fostering an environment conducive to investment, entrepreneurship, and inclusive growth, rather than relying on the printing press as a panacea. As we conclude our exploration of the currency conundrum, one thing becomes clear. True prosperity lies not in the printing press, but in the creativity, ingenuity, and hard work of individuals and nations. By embracing these principles, 
we can chart a course towards a future of shared prosperity and opportunity for all.